guys okay today we are going to learn another new topic which is called simultaneous equations okay so this simultaneous equation uh, is a very important topic because every year one question will come up in checkpoint eh? please please uh, uh, follow me carefully okay basically this simultaneous equation is uh, finding two lines two straight line uh, the intersection point of them what is the value of the x and y just like um, for example this case we have two lines like that after we, we, we have drawn these two lines they will intersect at a certain point which is here then we need to know where, what is the value of x here and what is the value of y here so a simultaneous equation answer always have two one is x and the other one will be the y value okay so follow this example I have one example here. Imagine that I ask you to draw this line, which is y equal to 2x plus 1. And also, I need to ask you to draw y equal to minus half x plus 6. Okay? So, we have learned how to draw um, a straight line, just like um, in previous video. So, I assume I, I have two coordinates uh, of x. I want to know the value of y. I want to draw it on this uh, plane. So, this is how I do. So, <clears throat> I'll substitute zero into two, uh, zero into x here. So two times zero will get zero. So my answer of y will be one. Eh? Then this one will be two times two. You get four. Four. Then you plus one. You get that's why you have five. So then I will plot it on, on this thing. Eh? So I have zero one, which is here, and the other one will be two five. Two five is here. So I'll join this with a ruler to form a straight line, which is going to be like this. You must draw this uh, uh, this line carefully because if you draw it sl slightly different, the answer because all the answer we are reading from the graph. If you draw it wrongly, then you you may read the answer wrong. Huh? So this has to be like this. Huh? I use I use uh, this one to draw. Okay, this is the line of uh, number one. Huh? The the one. Okay, the next one is this one, which is negative half x plus 6. I want to draw also. So I'll do the same thing. I choose 2x here. 2x from here. I just have to substitute. Then I get 6 here. Then this one will be uh, 8 times uh, divided by 2. You get 4 minus, minus 4. In the end, I have 2. Huh? So I have answer as 0, 6, which is here. And the other one is 8, 2. 8, 2 will be here. Okay, so I'll join this here so that I have I have the line so this is the second line this is the second line so I need to do this third one let's say this one third one is uh, half x minus 2 okay again I simply choose any uh, x figure so I, I, I still choose um, I choose negative 2 let's say and the other one I choose uh, 4 okay I multiply this with negative 2 I mean half time negative 2 I get negative 1 negative 1 minus 2 I get minus 3 eh? okay then 4 will multiply x and uh, multiply this uh, half so I get 2 2 minus 2 I get 0 okay so I have two coordinate again which is uh, minus 2 will be will be here minus 2 minus 3 is going to be here okay then 4 to 0 4 0 4 0 will be here so the line is going to be like this, passing through here and here. So this will be the third line. Okay, this is, is going to be the third line. Okay, now the question is like that. For simultaneous simultaneous equation, we always um, need two equations. Just like if I want to find intersection between line line one and line two, you can see there is one intersection here. Right, between these two, one, two. Huh? That means the simultaneous answer for this one and two will be here. Huh? So your answer, the x value is going to be two and the y value is five. Okay, this is your answer. That means we always have two answers. One is for x, one is for y. This is the answer that the question one. Simultaneous between line one and line two with which you read from here line 1 and line 2 they are going to meet here so the answer is 2 and 5 okay if I want to know the intersection between line 1 and 3 
that will be here so if 1 and 3 that means our answer will be x x will be equal to minus 2 and the y value is going to be here which is minus 3 here y is minus 3 okay that is the two answer between line 1 and line 3 okay we may also have 2 and 3 okay let's say the line between 2 and 3 I want to know the simultaneous between 2 and 3 okay this line and this line so I will read from here line 2 is like that line 3 is like that they are meeting at this point which is 8 and 2 huh? so that means our answer for this will be 8 for x y for 2 huh? that will be your final answer so you can see from here we are actually doing simultaneous with two lines at each time huh? at each time one time is only two you cannot have three all together so at two by two either these two either one and two uh, one and two and uh, one and three or two and three depends on the question normally the question is only ask you to compare two lines huh? like doing simultaneous for two lines huh? it's just like this case two lines and you see these two only so you can see from here you ask for simultaneous between this line and this line so all you have to do is just draw this line draw this line on the paper this one after that you see the intersection point that will be your final answer okay let's try it out with the exercise that i will give you later thank you